Hello friends, welcome to DP Tutorials. Please subscribe to DP Tutorials and click on the bell icon for notifications. In this tutorial, let us learn how to update progress in Primavera P6. So, let us open a sample project and set the layout to show like this with four compulsory columns that are start, finish, baseline start and baseline finish. There are two ways to update any project schedule. One is updating manually and other is automatically using the update progress built-in option which is present in the tools tab like this. Remember friends, you need to use this update progress feature only when your project is going exactly as per the baseline plan. If not, you should be using the manual method only. Let us select this activity chemical dosing plant whose start date is 4th June 2020 and go to tools and click on update progress. This is the automatic process. You will get the update progress dialog box like this with different options to select. It is asking whether all the highlighted activities to be updated or selected activities only. You can change the data date here, for example, put as 5th June 2020. Then it will automatically highlight all those activities falling before 5th June, which is nothing but the spotlight feature. You can click on apply button so as to update automatically all those activities. But I'm selecting the second option to update only the selected activity only now. Click apply button and you can observe that the start date 4th June has been considered as actual start date. But it is suggested that we should not be using this method of automatically updating when our schedule is not following the exact baseline plan. So. The ideal method is to update manually. Like for example, the activity equipment move in skids is supposed to be started on 26th June. Suppose it has started on 15th June 2020 and I am updating it manually like this. Go to details, go to status tab and check the start checkbox here and enter the date as 15th June 2020. And you can also enter the percentage of progress. If I would have run the automatic way for this activity, the start date would have been the same as baseline date, which is 26th, but it won't recognize the actual date, which is the earlier date that is 15th June. Okay, friends, in this way, you need to update all the activities manually and then schedule the project to see the overall impact and compare this with the baseline plan. So friends, this is all about how to update progress in Primavera P6. If you have enjoyed this tutorial, please give me a like, share and comment. For further more interesting videos, please do subscribe DP Tutorials. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.